Hello, 16 Days of Activism Against Gender-Based Violence is an annual campaign that starts on the 25th of November, the International Day for the Elimination of Violence Against Women, and runs until the 10th of December. This year marks the campaign's 30th anniversary. People from any gender can experience violence and domestic abuse. However, we acknowledge that a disproportionate number of women experience this violence. Of course, we know that men and boys are also victims of this abuse and it's important that we include them and recognise and also su provide support and services. The Crime Survey of England and Wales estimates that one in three women will experience domestic abuse in their lifetime and on average a woman is killed by her male partner or former partner every four days in England and Wales. In our borough we have had the highest police reported rates of domestic abuse in the country. The impact of domestic abuse ripples through our community and has a profound impact every day on our victims, on their families and children. Our services see the impact of this abuse and the prevalence is far too high. That's why we launched our Domestic Abuse Commission, the first of its kind in the UK. It brought together a panel of national experts to look at the issue and to make a series of recommendations about what we needed to do to make the long-term change. Over the next five years, we'll be working towards implementing the recommendations of the report. Currently, the Council provides, along with its partners, a range of support services for those affected by domestic abuse and we use every opportunity to raise public visibility of the issue. We launched our campaign, We Believe You, to ensure that victims' survivor voices are heard. As a community, we all have a role to play in raising awareness of domestic abuse and supporting family, friends or colleagues by educating ourselves about services and checking in on one another. If you are experiencing domestic abuse, please know this. We believe you and you're not alone. There is help available. We have services in place who can provide support and give you access to a safe space and provide emotional support as well. If you are experiencing domestic abuse, please contact the number on the screen. If you're in immediate danger, then contact the police. This borough is committed to tackling violence against women and girls, ensuring that future generations can live a life in healthy relationships. This is our aspiration. Thank you. As Councillor Warby has highlighted, violence against women and girls is a major issue across the country with the deaths of Sabina Nessa and Sarah Everard still on our minds, who unfortunately, like many other women, have lost their lives to, to such violence. In Barking and Dagenham, we want to make sure women feel safe when they're walking around the borough. And earlier in the year, we run a survey where we ask women, tell us where you don't feel safe. And we've listened. You've told us where you don't feel safe and we have visited three of the key hotspots that were highlighted. So we saw the issues for ourselves, as well as increasing security and enforcement patrols at Barking Station and the London Road car park. We're also looking to increase CCTV and lighting in highlighted areas, as well as increased joint patrols with the police across the borough. However, we know there is more to do. And although these measures help in the short term, longer term more needs to be done to educate some men about what is acceptable and what is respectable behavior towards women we'll also be launching our safe haven scheme which will provide safe places all around the borough if you feel threatened or harassed these places may include shops cafes news agents hairdressers or libraries alongside the police we will continue to improve safety and perceptions of safety in barking and dagenham thank you